a very good morning students today we are going to discuss the short long answer questions of the chapter light so your very first question is what do you mean by the term reflection of light so what is reflection of light the bouncing back of the light in the same medium after striking the surface so this is on your page number 51 or you can write from recapitulation how is a plane mirror made so how it is made it is on page number 51 that it is made by silvering one side and making other side as reflecting the very first paragraph of this topic next is explain the following terms incident ray reflected ray angle of incidence angle of reflection and normal these definitions are on your page number 52 or it is available to you in your notes that i have provided you next is draw a diagram showing the reflection of light ray from a plane mirror label it the incident, the reflected, the normal, the angle of incidence and the angle of reflection. This is your figure 4.3. If you have already drawn it in your notebook, then no need to draw again. State the two laws of reflection of light. This is on your page number 53. First law is that the angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection. The normal, the incident and the reflected ray all lie in same plane. Next is describe an experiment to verify the laws of reflection. This is not in your syllabus so no need to do this question. Next is a ray of light falls normally on a plane mirror. What is the angle of incidence? So here this is on your page number 54. You have to take a ray of light which is falling normally so the angle of incidence will be zero degree and the angle of reflection also will be zero degree next is your question number eight draw a diagram to show the reflection of a light ray incident normally on a plane mirror so this is the same question that is seven here in question number eight you have to draw only the diagram that when a incident ray is falling normally on a plane mirror it will retrace its path so this is your figure 4.7 next is your question number 9 draw uh, the diagram in figure 4.18 shows an incident ray AO and the reflected ray OB from a plane mirror the angle AOB is 30 degree and you have to draw a no normal and find the angle of incidence and angle of reflection. So here you can see I have drawn the normal ON here, here and the angle AOB is your 30 degree. These are given to you. Then we have to find angle I and angle R. So as we know that the sum of angle I and angle R is 30. So here we have written angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection. So angle AON plus BON will be equals to your 30 degree. Angle I plus angle R is 30 degree. But angle I equals to angle R. So in place of R also we have written angle I. So twice of angle I is 30. Angle I is 15. 30 divided by 2 is 15. So angle of incidence is equals to angle of reflection which is 15 degree. Next is your question number 10 that in the following diagrams you have to measure and write the angle of incidence and draw the reflected ray in each case. So in the first one you can see this is incident normally here it is making 90 degree angle so it will retrace its path. So I have drawn the arrow in the backward direction. Next is B part. You can measure with the help of protector. The angle of incidence is 30 degree. So angle of reflection also I have made 30 degree. 
एंगल सी यू कैन डू बाई योर सेल्फ इट विल बी फिफ्टी डिग्री नेक्स्ट इज योर क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन दैट हेर अ डायग्राम इज गिवन टू यू एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस इज गिवन टू यू यू हैव टू ड्रॉ द एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन सो इफ एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस इज सिक्सटी एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन विल ऑल्सो बी सिक्सटी नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेल्व द फॉलोइंग डायग्राम शोज एन इंसिडेंट रे ए ओ एंड द नॉर्मल ओ एन ऑन द प्लेन मेरर फाइंड द एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस एंड एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन सो हेयर आई हैव मेड द डायग्राम एंगल ए ओ एम इज गिवन टू यू विच इज थर्टी डिग्री दिस इज योर एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस दिस इज योर एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन एंगल दिस इज ओ एन इज परपेंडिकुलर टू द प्लेन मिरर सो दिस कंप्लीट एंगल विल बी नाइंटी डिग्री सो एंगल आई प्लस एंगल ए ओ एम इज इक्वल टू योर नाइंटी डिग्री एंगल आई प्लस एंगल थर्टी इज नाइंटी डिग्री एंगल आई इज नाइंटी माइनस थर्टी सो एंगल आई कम्स आउट टू बी सिक्सटी डिग्री अकॉर्डिंग टू लॉज ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन एंगल आई इक्वल्स टू एंगल आर सो एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन इज ऑल्सो सिक्सटी डिग्री नेक्स्ट इज योर क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन स्टेट इन वर्ड्स हाउ डू यू फाइंड द लोकेशन ऑफ इमेज ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट फॉर्म्ड बाय अ प्लेन मिरर सो हाउ यू फाइंड द लोकेशन द ऑब्जेक्ट इज at the same distance from the mirror as the image is the distance between image and the mirror and the image and the object is same so this is on your page number 54 draw a ray diagram showing the formation of image of an point object by a plane mirror so this is on your page number 54 the image formation of an point object by the plane mirror that diagram i think you already have drawn if you haven't drawn then you can draw otherwise no need next is your question number 15 that they have given you a point object that is o which is placed in front of a mirror and then you have to take two rays from the point o and show how the image is formed and seen by the eye so this is your plane mirror this object is in front of this mirror and then i have taken two incident rays and these are your reflected rays when produced backward they will form the image and these reflected rays reach our eye next is question number 16 state four characteristics of the image formed by a plane mirror this is on your page number 56 how is the position of an image formed by a plane mirror related to the position of the object they are at the same distance from the mirror you are standing at a distance 2 meter from the plane mirror what is the distance between your image from the mirror so distance will be same that is 2 meter and what is the distance between you and your image it will be 2 plus 2 that is 4 meter what is meant by lateral inversion of an image in a plane mirror so this you can write from page number 50 along with this you can draw the diagram which is given to you in your book write down the letter c and i as seen in the plane mirror so here i have made i will be same but the c will be opposite got it beta next what is reg irregular reflection give an example so this you can write from page number 57 or in recapitulation also it is given how do we see objects around us this you can write from recapitulation we are able to see things around us because of irregular reflection state two uses of plane mirror this you can write from page number 57 many uses are given you can write any two can light travel in vacuum yes light can travel and the speed of light in vacuum is 3 into 10 raised to power 8 meter per second state the speed of light in air and glass in air it is 3 into 10 raised to power 8 and in glass it is 2 into 10 raised to power 8 state whether slide slows down or speed up in the following cases 
so when light going from air to glass it will slow down when it is going from glass to water it will speed up when going from water to air it will speed up what are the primary colors name the primary colors so this you can write from page number 58 secondary colors also 58 and 59 then fill ups are there blue plus green equals to cyan red plus blue plus green equals to white blue plus red equals to magenta and green plus red equals to yellow leaves appear green when seen in white light give a reason this is on your page number 60 that it reflects only the green color and absorbs the rest of colors a rose appear red in white light how will it appear in green light so in white light if it is red in green light it will be black and if we see it in red light it will be bright red so reason is on your page number 60 only that when seen in green light it will absorb the green light it will be absorbing all the colors so it appears black but when it is seen in red light it will reflect the red color red light and because of that it will look like bright red why does a piece of paper appear white when seen in sunlight how will you expect it to appear when viewed in red light so it will appear red because it will reflect the red light a piece of paper appears black in sunlight how will it appear in red light so it will appear black because it will absorb the light of all the colors and reflect none so i hope all these questions are clear to you if any doubt is there you can ask in your whatsapp group so thank you have a good day